All right, Joey Strube here, Bike Man Performance. Today we're going to bring you to the internet, to our website, bikemanperformance.com. So first, uh, just search Bike Man Performance. And it will come to our awesome website. And you want to go to the .com one because that's where all the cool stuff is. And right on the top, you'll see a tech tab. Uh, you want to go down to the clutch weight calculator. This is a neat calculator I designed that will allow you to make different changes to inputs. And it'll show you what the output will be. So if you change the horsepower of your machine, if you, you know, change your RPM target, what changes you'll have to make to your clutch weights to match your power to the right RPM. So let's go down here. Now from here, we're gonna roll this up a little bit. So the first thing right here, you'll see is horsepower. So let's just say we have 170 horsepower uh, snowmobile and it runs at 8,200 RPM. Uh, it's running a installed rate, so that's the first spring rate, a 160, 320. And I'm just making stuff up here, but this is just uh, so you can see what you have to fill in. So now, say we're on a Polaris, this is a three-arm clutch, and our elevation is zero to 2,000 feet. And I did say it was a Polaris, so we'll go here. So now, let's uh, go up, and you can see that with the horsepower, it's making would require 71 grams of weight. So we can change that finish rate on the spring to 330, and you're gonna see how that has a, an effect on the outcome. So the neat thing is, we, if our package changes for this engine, where now we're making 170 horsepower, or let's say 180 horsepower, say you went for the full stage three, and the RPM is at 8450, we can see what effect it has on our weight. And now we're gonna be running 72.6 grams, and still has an engagement at 3100, because as you can see, uh, the main thing that affects your engagement is the spring preload. So say we went to a 160 preload, uh, now all of a sudden we're at 4,300. So if you want a lot revier takeoff to begin with, you can play with that uh, spring installed rate and see what effect that has. So you can choose your next spring for your clutch. If you want to set up your own stuff, uh, you can use that as a good indicator of how much that's going to affect your engagement RPM. And as well as uh, the finish rate, you can see what effect that has on your weight demands. And this is a really neat tool. Uh, you know, your secondary setup is going to have a little effect, but this is going to get you really close, and you'll be able to know, uh, you know, what you'll need. So uh, this is another neat part: is the altitude and elevation. So say, you know, you're at six to eight thousand feet. You're going to see that because the engine naturally loses power as you go up in elevation, you can see that it drops to like 65 grams. So so let's require drastically less weight as you go up in elevation just because of that horsepower loss from loss of oxygen. So this is on our website and we got a bunch of other cool stuff on there. Feel free to check that out too. All our stuff is at bikemanperformance.com. See you next time.